Good morning, my friends. I hope all of you are having an awesome, fantastic day. And hello from Gatlinburg. So we're starting off this morning just driving around, trying to look at the Smoky Mountains, and then we're heading down to Pigeon Forge to do some exploring. It's gonna be a fun day. I hope you guys are ready because I am. Let's go do this. We are now heading up to the Great Smoky Mountains National Park. Look at this. I love it here. Check it out. We can see the Smokies. By the way, there's Gatlinburg. Right there. It's so peaceful. Man. So one thing that's pretty challenging and difficult is finding places to eat. I wanted to come here to the local GOAT because I've read pretty good reviews, but look at this parking lot. It is full. Hopefully we can get in. Let's go see. Look at the logo here. I love that. By the way, we got a table. One thing we just found out about this place, everything is made in-house from scratch. We got the fried deviled eggs. These look amazing, and of course, a sweet tea. Those were amazing. Everything I wanted and more, I highly recommend those. Well, something very exciting just happened. I asked, and they have Buffalo Trace in stock. This stuff has been so difficult to find lately because I think they're having a shortage, but they have it here. I'm excited. Cheers. That's so good. Our food is here. Bianca got the Southern chicken salad. That looks amazing. And then I got the Tennessee whiskey burger with French fries. That's like a big hamburger, my goodness. I think I need to say this again because I don't know too many restaurants around that will do this, but everything is made in house from your buns to the simple syrup in your drinks, all the juices. We have a fantastic server. I actually liked Bianca's salad a little bit more than my hamburger. I really enjoyed the burger though because it had like a Tennessee whiskey glaze. When you take each bite, you can taste how fresh everything is. Come here. If you guys are in the area, come here and thank me later. And for dessert, we got the white chocolate bread pudding. My, oh my. If you guys are familiar with Ohana at Disney's Polynesian Resort for dinner, they had a bread pudding. Lately, I feel like Disney has been cutting a few corners when it comes to their food quality, but this was better than the Ohana bread pudding, and that's saying a lot. It was white chocolate, very dense, very rich. It was just delicious. This whole experience has been amazing. Again, I highly recommend this place easily. 10 out of 10. Yeah, we're gonna come back. Hello there, King Kong. Man, there's a ton of nearby roadside attractions all over the place. We just left the local goat and now we're here at Goats on the Roof. Yes. There's goats on the roof. <laughs> That's what I'm about to do. But first, hello, fellas. They're like, what's up? <laughs> oh, this one's so cute. Not saying you guys aren't adorable, but. <laughs> eating away. Looks like it's a antique shop as well. Lots of really cool items look at this believe I told you guys there's goats on the roof very nice concept in my opinion so I ended up driving down the road to this one just because they were giving me a little bit of a hard time about my GoPro plus this one looks insane look at that here we go Thank you. 
it's so cold. <laughs> oh yes, it doesn't get better than this. I love Tennessee. Man, we are going all the way up this mountain. The drop is going to be insane. I cannot wait. I'm so excited for this. Here we go, we're off. Woo! Oh my. Picking up speed. Whoa! <laughs> this is awesome! Woo! <laughs> Woo! Oh man! Woo -hoo. <laughs> oh! My eyes are watering! Woo! That was so much fun. That's definitely the best mountain coaster I've been on here in Pigeon Forge, Tennessee. That was like really fast. I enjoyed myself so much. It was $18 and then if you want to ride again, it's only $10. Just announced not that long ago, Dollywood is making a brand new resort called Heart Song Lodge and Resort. It's supposed to open fall of 2023 and it's going to be built right back in this direction, which is in the corner of Dreamore, which is right here, as we are pulling back in. We made it back up to the room, and I just wanted to show you guys how close we are to Splash Country. Right there. Well, once again, we try to eat breakfast here at the historic Old Mill, but the line is just too crazy. Yeah. I believe right now, an hour and 45 minute wait. We are trying to get kettle popcorn, but it <laughs> seems like every booth and stand is closed it for the was season. It open though, earlier. Was it? The other day, yeah, during the evening. Well, dang. Well, let's go over to the Old Forge Distillery. They have coconut moonshine, chocolate, Key lime, oatmeal cookie, which is my personal favorite, vanilla bean, coffee, lemon moonshine, orange moonshine, French toast, apple pie, which is really good, caramel, cola, cinnamon, peach, blackberry, and pineapple. And that's where they make it every day, right here. And if you come here to Pigeon Forge and you don't have your own form of transportation, they do offer trolleys. I don't know how much these are, but this is an option. I'll take you all around Pigeon Forge and possibly Gatlinburg as well. A few days later, we have made it back here to Central Florida. And let me tell you guys, I love the weather here in Florida. A few days ago, we were freezing. Today, we could get back in the pool if we wanted to. So. It's a nice option to have to live here in Florida, but what a trip out to Dollywood for the winter time for Christmas. We got to experience Dollywood Smoky Mountain Christmas in full effect this year. We ate some good food. We got to explore Pigeon Forge, the local goat. Holy cow, that restaurant was phenomenal. I highly recommend that place. That is something where when and if I come back, that's something I will definitely do every time and then some. Also, the mountain coaster, that was so much fun. But overall, we really enjoyed this trip out to Tennessee as a family. We got to do a lot on camera, but we did a lot off camera. And another big thank you to Dollywood for taking care of us. Let me talk about right now though. So we just got back home from Tennessee a few days ago and we're already checked into our next adventure. We're staying at a vacation home or an Airbnb and this Airbnb is themed to your favorite Disney villains. This entire property is themed to Disney villains. 
I can't wait to show you guys this place. It's so much fun. We've been enjoying every minute here. But that is all that I have for you guys today. Thank you for watching. I love you guys. Thank you for all the love, all the support. I really do appreciate it no matter what. I'll see you guys in the next video. Prince Charming, out. I am feeling lonely In a morning minute it's time to end the ride Fading it too slowly Where those gonna lift me up this time You were the only One who got me tripping up inside